Hey everyone, this is Cash Company back at it with another video for our clients. As you know, we've been trying our best to make videos of different scenarios and answering any questions you have relating to precious metals. For this video, we want to show you how we examine metals that look identical. When it comes to metals, one of the biggest confusion people seem to have is establishing what white gold, silver, platinum, or white copper look like. It's crazy how often we have clients come in with valuables without knowing it. Here we have a couple of rings, which all look similar, but are made up of different metals. First things first, you want to check the marking for a clue. Gold will have a carat stamp, while silver will usually say 925 or STER for sterling. Platinum is the easiest to read, as it almost always will say plat. Now you might ask what happens if an item isn't stamped. Well, the easiest way to find out what you have is to get it evaluated. We use an x-ray device, such as this one. Uh, to check exactly what your valuables are made up of. For example, we have this ring right here, which isn't stamped. By running it in, in the x-ray, we can tell exactly what the ring is made up of. So it says 10 carats, gold, and it's mixed with other metals as well. Here we have a platinum ring. Now nice diamonds are usually put into platinum or white gold jewelry because it highlights its color. But here we have some silver rings. Go ahead and put one into the machine. Right. See AG for silver. and white copper. White copper doesn't have a stamp as well. You could run it in. You can see copper, it does have a nickel content as well. Hope this helps. Let us know what you'd want to see in our next video.